From the menu, choose Developer, select Insert, and from ActiveX controls, choose Command Button, drag a Command Button to the size required, double click the Command Button to enter the VBA editor, ensure the Command Button is selected from the Element drop down list, and ensure Click is selected from the Procedure drop down list. Underneath the private subcommand, type range, open brackets or parentheses, open quotation marks, and to the cell range you want to copy. So let's say you want to copy cell range A1 to A10. Turn to our VBA editor, type A1, colon, A10, close quotation marks, close brackets or parentheses, type dot, and then copy, then enter a space. Now we enter the destination that we're copying to. Begin by typing worksheets because we're copying it to another worksheet open brackets or parentheses open quotation marks take the name of the worksheet you're copying to close quotation marks close brackets or parentheses type dot range open brackets or parentheses open quotation marks enter the range on sheet 2 that you're copying to so we're going to use a5 colon a15 close quotation marks close brackets or parentheses then if we click we turn to excel and if we exit design mode you can see currently sheet 2 is empty so we click our command button to copy and on sheet 2 our data has been copied if you wanted to copy another range of data with the same button you could extend the range or we go back into design mode you could repeat that line of code and modify your range parameters return to excel exit design mode now you can see in sheet 2 we just have the one range return to sheet 1 execute our command and both ranges have been copied. Subscribe for more computer tips and hacks. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.